Hello community, I hope you are doing good. In this discussion, we will see how to perform mass editing in Odoo. And in case you missed the previous discussion about how to control your controllers in Odoo side, especially for the portal as well as for the website related controller, please check link is given in the description and the portal development related feature already available in the playlist make sure you can visit that playlist and if you want to learn more about odoo you can visit the weblands channel under the playlist you can see odoo development and here you can see different playlists available with different topic wise with the real test cases and in case you need any support related odoo you can visit the about page and send your query to this email address code is also available in the github make sure you can follow this git repository and we have some different social media pages make sure you can follow to get the latest notification so let's back to our main topic like how you can perform mass editing in odoo side all right so let's go to the student profile and in the list view here so let's say if you want to update anything here in the preview right especially in the tree view so we already so like how you can also perform right instead of this form view that is also possible so for that i'm going to here in the custom add-ons school dot students right and the views here you can see this is our tree view for the student right so let me copy this one and let me command and i will remove this one and i will use as a editable bottom right after that like let's say i will i have to upgrade this module why because we change it the xml side so now simple i will go to in the terminal of this pycharm in the configurable screen and i will try to upgrade this module in the backend side if in case you don't know how to configure odoo in pycharm please check editor level playlist i already explained and here let me refresh the screen and once I will click here, so it's it's not open the form view, but here you can see it's available as a edit view, right? So let's say I want to change some some of the record as a draft state, right? So as a general practice, we are select uh, we are trying to uh, go to the specific record and click to draft mode, right? And change here like this, like paid or let's say draft or let's say draft or like that right so this is the manual process okay now what about the mass editing let's say i want to update four records or let's say more than one record to update as a draft here we done is one two and three three records we updated as manually right one by one but here how you can also perform the mass editing so for that we have to add here one more attribute which is multi underscore edit and simple we have to click uh, we have to pass here the value as a one right by default it is a zero and once you upgrade this module and once you refresh the screen now let's say you want to again let's say this 4 13 and 17 uh seven record you have to this ids you have to add as a paid or anything else right so for that we have to click this record right after that we have to change any of this one let's say progress and now you can see this pop-up screen also appear here are you sure you want to perform the following update on these three records right because we selected here three records now you can see the field and uh, the new value which we selected here if you will cancel right it won't be updated but let's say if you will click to this ok button it will automatically update to these three records all right so like this way the mass editing feature will work here you can see we are using this editable bottom right but what about you don't want to use this feature this specific attribute that is also fine you can just remove right then after you can upgrade the module you can refresh the screen all right and you can let's say select 
or let's say you can select all the records and simple in a random any of the record you can go and click to the you can select the specific record option or you can add anything and once I will click you can see it's updated all the records the selected record is only all right now let's say if I will remove this attributes this attribute to right and I will upgrade this module so what so let's check is it working mass editing here in the tree view or not all right so let's um, select this one and once I will click you can see it's automatically open this form view so by default multi edit option is zero right you have to enable then you have to write down like multi edit and pass the value as a one and after that like let me upgrade the one more on this module and after that it's working fine so let's say these three records we selected i want to update as a null right so after that it will work now let's say if i want to open the form view that is also fine i can click to here and it's open this form view screen all right so this is the feature how you can mass edit in a bulk mass edit records right using this multi underscore edit equal to one attribute all right if you have any doubt related to this topic please comment below and see you in our next session